What's going on guys? Welcome to the channel. Today I have a special video for you and this one is brought to you by Funsid. So first things first, let me go ahead and unbox this and I'll show you guys what we got. Okay, so as you guys can see, this is going to be one of those right on power wheels for kids. And it comes in two different boxes. So one is going to be the uh, vehicle itself and the other one comes with the wheels and probably some suspension parts. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this out of the box and we'll get back to you. Okay guys, so I have everything unboxed and just laid out so I can show you guys everything that comes with it. Uh, so as I said, it comes in two different boxes. Uh, if you order this online um, assembly, you know like it does come with the instructions manual which we'll go through as we are assembling it but just looking at all the pieces here uh, we have a light bar which these are actual working lights and you can see we have the connection on this side and then the front windshield which also is a see-through windshield and the light bar on top actually works other than that, we have the front fender flares, uh, running boards for the side of the Jeep. We have the steering wheel, side mirrors, and we have handrails for the back right here. Now over here I have some of the main components, which is going to be the left and right side motor. They are labeled each, so uh, we know which side they go on. We also have the charging wire, the adapter to charge the batteries. Um, this is for an auxiliary cable. Now you'd be surprised, but this one actually has a working radio with USB, and you could also uh, connect the uh, auxiliary cord and listen to your own music from your phone. Another thing, this is helpful for parents with small children. If they're not ready to write on their own, you could actually control it with a remote control. So we also have the hardware right here. And coming over to this side, we have the four wheels. Very beautiful wheels. Um, so they also come with the caps. And here is the, um, the steering rack, the front suspension. So I also wanna show that this has springs for the front suspension. And not only that, on the rear it has uh, some shocks with springs so it actually has uh, suspension on the vehicle look at this front end these are beautiful headlights very beautiful right here this is just a reflective is uh, I don't think this is a working light uh, but if we look under the hood I had already popped it right here we have two batteries and these are going to be 12 volts each so you have the option of running 12 volts or 24 volts there's the speaker for the radio and here is the control for the uh, remote control um, this is uh, the little antenna wire right here for the signal and that's pretty much it I'm gonna go ahead and get the instructions manual and I'm gonna go ahead and follow it step by step as we build this Jeep so follow me along as I build it.
Okay, so here's the Jeep and everything was pretty easy to install, to assemble, thanks to the instructions, uh, the guidebook right here. Uh, all the instructions are just easy to follow. It only took me about 25 to 30 minutes, give or take, and that is because I was recording everything. Um, so this right here comes with either five different color options. One, this is pink, but they also have white, silver, red, blue, and black. This is a 24 volt model. So opening the hood with these two clips right here, we'll notice that we have two batteries. So these are 12 volts each. So you can run on one battery or you can run on both. Down here we have the wireless control. So this is so you can control the car with the remote control, which I'll get to it in a second. Um, so this is still an electric vehicle. So it is not recommended to use this in the rain or to wash it with running water. If you're gonna clean this, simply get a damp cloth and just wipe it. So we have a lot of uh, electronics exposed like the motor or the control center right here. So, I'll give you guys a walkthrough right here on the control center. We can turn on the vehicle and back here you'll see that the light bar automatically turns on. Just above the windshield we also have another light bar that turns on. And also the headlights, look at those beautiful headlights. So, and not only that, but on the back of the vehicle, the tail lights also light up. So, the attention to detail is just amazing on this. Uh, the, it also has a complete suspension with spring and shock. So, you know, whenever the passenger gets in. Um, the door has a lock from the inside to where you can open it. Passenger gets in, close it, and you can lock it. So very cool. Right here on the interior, let's take a quick look at it. We have the control center right here and some little gauges right there, steering wheel. So looking right here at the control center. So one button is the lamp. So pushing that one will turn either on or off the lamps. Now over here are the drive controls. So we have the back lights up blue forward it lights up green and it also has the speed so it has the uh, for slow or for fast so right now fast meaning 24 volts or you can uh, switch to slow and 12 volts um, it also has a radio it has preset songs in it There's a dog, but I... and I... very loud so um, we'll put that on pause. We don't want copyright issues. Uh, speaking of copyright, right here I have my phone. And if we hit right here on this wireless connection, we turn on the Bluetooth. So on the phone, you can just uh, go down on the Bluetooth device. And the Bluetooth is going to be the J Junior 20. So we'll connect, we'll get a confirmation sound. Hit done and and YouTube these are all non copyright music so please do not copyright my video but uh, from here we can also change the songs and we'll just pause that one for now so it also has the auxiliary button right here and they also include a auxiliary cable so you can plug this one in and on the back of your phone. So, wireless connection. Pretty cool. Um, we're gonna go ahead and just uh, turn this off. To charge this, it is recommended to plug in the vehicle side first, and then we'll get the power adapter, and then we'll connect it on the outlet. So, um, it is also like uh, recommended on the instruction manual to leave it charging for the first time somewhere between 8 to 12 hours uh, just to make sure that everything is completely charged, both batteries completely charged. This indicator will light up red when it's charging or green when it is fully charged. 
but I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna go ahead and just uh, charge the vehicle make sure it's fully charged and then we'll take it out to test it okay so after just a few short hours the batteries are now fully charged so let's go ahead and uh, take this out and have fun with it okay it's open hey look Get in. Look, let me take open the seat belt. So this being the first time that the girls owned one of these vehicles and are still unfamiliar with how to drive it on their own, this is a perfect time to use the remote control. After you install two AAA batteries, the remote control gives you full access to the vehicle and will cancel out any electronics in the vehicle while the remote control is being used. The vehicle is also equipped with two 200 watt motors and a 24 volt battery that will give you a run time of about two hours uninterrupted driving. Now the vehicle is equipped with a strong metal suspension that can support a maximum weight of 130 pounds and this vehicle is perfect for kids between the ages of 3 and 8 years old. Featuring a realistic appearance and high performance, the Funset 24 volt ride-on vehicle is the ideal gift for both boys and girls. to work on it, mechanic. Pop it like that. Something wrong with it? You got no gas in it? Those are lights. It's a Jeep thing, huh? Can you say thank you? Thank you. Good job. Thank you. Wow, what is that? Whoa, that's, the engine. That, that's the engine. The engine is in here? The engine. And the batteries. Okay, let's close it. Good job. Okay guys, so that is going to be it for today. I just want to give a huge thanks to Funsit for sponsoring today's video. The kids absolutely love this vehicle. If you guys are interested, I'll have all the links down in the description box or pinned in the top comment. And uh, I'm pretty sure if you guys get one of these for your child, I am absolutely positive they will enjoy this vehicle. So that is going to be it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and I hope to see you guys on the next one. Peace out.